just get punched in the face for thinking I'm just a YouTuber. This is fucking dirt. I don't give a fuck what you nigga, you, you right there. You with a fat ass mom that just walked past and shit. Yeah, you, yeah, your mom is fat as fuck, nigga. You about to talk in my comments. Suck my with your mother's mother's lip, nigga. Okay, YouTube, it's your boy Upper Class, and you are now tuned in to the Realist Reaction channel on the tube. I need everyone to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. Today is not a reaction video. Today, we gonna address all the shit y'all been talking about. You feel me? So, let's just straight into it. And for you niggas that always go straight to the comment section before you watch a video, Watch the video before you go to the comment section. Because whenever you go to the comment section before watching the video, it's almost as if you do not have the right thinking. You don't have the right judgment because you're going off of what everyone else is saying. Now you feel obligated to say the, thing, the same thing that everyone else is saying. So watch the video yourself and get your own opinion before you go to the comment section. Alright, so what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to play some throwback videos before any altercations, throwback videos of me reacting to certain artists. I'm going to do five um, GD rappers and I'm going to do five GD, K, and Wu rappers, right? So, I'm going to break it down to y'all and I'm going to get back after and then we're going to talk about it. Gotta get some stats, keep a knock, just get a nigga flat. If he I believe his body, yeah. so the niggas really get him flat. Trap and jug it, gotta get some stats, keep a knock, just get a nigga flat. If he I believe his body flat, just so the niggas really get him flat. Nah, this shit is fire. He, yeah, the comeback. He came back with some shit. He came back with some shit. This right here, this shit is fire. I fuck with this shit. I get a shit, no funny shit. I get a shit at 8.3, my nigga. This shit is fire. I'll fuck with this shit. I get a shit at 8. I give him an 8.5, bro. No cap. No cap. Because the reason why I give him an 8.5, is another a lot of people gonna comment that. Oh, you gave other tracks uh eight, you gave other tracks this. Uh, no. The reason why I give him 8.5, because this is his best shit ever. This is best shit I ever heard from him. Like this shit right here is fire. I fuck with it. He was on beat. He flowed. He wasn't missing tempos. None of that shit. You feel me? The visual good. All that shit came together properly. I fuck with this shit. And I get that shit. I get that shit 8.5. So I know cap. You know what I mean? I'm not going to be one of them biased ass niggas and be like, oh, yeah. Oh, because he this and his association make me judge it the wrong way. Like I tell y'all, the realest fucking reaction channel on YouTube. Man. I'm the realest, you feel me? So I'm going to keep it real. I don't care what nobody else has to say. I'm going to keep it real. Ain't no picking the choosing. We gon' keep it in the street. Ain't no speaking the music. From Flatbush to the bill, we still dropping the hook. If you rock with GS9, then we clap you too. It's my fucking city, nigga. This is my fucking city, nigga. Coco, twirl me how you fuck. Saying yes, city, nigga. It's my city, nigga. Fuck on with you. And I rock with GS9. Hold the fuck up. Fuck on my, you rock with GS9. Nigga, you're not even. You ain't got that much weight in here. Anyway, man, I ain't gonna front. He walked on this shit. You feel me? Even though he just said a bunch of bullshit at the end, but he walked on this shit. He was talking spicy for real. This shit is, this shit is he. I fuck with him. He did an 8 out of 10. He did his thing. You feel me? He did his thing. Even though he's talking about certain money that I know and shit, he still did his thing. You feel me? I can't discredit him because he said certain shit about people I know. That'd be me being fake. And y'all know I'm the realest reaction channel on YouTube. I keep it 100 no matter what. Even if a nigga diss me and I'm reacting to his diss track and he says some fire shit, I'm going to be like, it's fire. You feel me? But it's your boy Upper Class, man. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell notification. Nah, he took it bully, you are bully, you are bully. I like that, I like that. This 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 the rap that I like. I like when niggas go for other niggas and niggas say niggas names and keep them on honey. I like that real shit, man. Bring that real shit back. Y'all bitch ass niggas all talking about, oh, I ain't mentioning his name because he looking for clout. Oh, I ain't responding to him because he nigga. It's a competition. Show niggas who the best is, nigga. 
Nigga, show your talent. If you say you nice at rapping, show niggas your talent, nigga. Stop talking about niggas looking for clout. Respond, nigga. Fuck are you talking about? I like this shit right here. He put niggas' names. He dropped Herb name. He said he murked them. <laughs> I like this shit. Go cap. I like this shit. This the diss track shit I'm talking about. You feel me? This the... Oh, that shit done. It's just the hook. Turn got the nice little melody, the visual match the song. You feel me? They actually in the party. They got bitches. You feel me? Mingling with the niggas, the bottles and all that. That shit look lit. Look lit. You feel me? I get a shit eight point two. Y'all comment in the comment section below. Let me know what y'all think, man. I ain't picking no sides. We ain't got no favoritism. You know, I keep it a stack on here. Let me know if I already it too high or already it too low. I ain't gonna I like this shit. I get this shit a solid eight too. I like this shit. Feel me some flow delivery. You know what I mean? Some be some be rapping. Some the Chris Lee nigga I fuck with. The young J nigga, he, so I fuck with his shit too and shit. Feel me? These niggas, these niggas did their shit on this shit. It was it was good money. You feel me? I give it a solid eight. Y'all comment in the comment section below and let me know if y'all think I rated. <laughs> I ain't gonna front. I ain't gonna front, Lee. You gotta add this L to the end of your name. Cause this was not it. Nah. Nah. This is not it. Yo, fat L I said fat L. Fat leaf is not cutting it, bro. You gotta go back to skinny leaf, bro. You feel me? Before you went in, like, you know what I mean? Front. I ain't gonna front. The beat is hard and shit. You feel me? The beat got me rocking, but I feel like they could have did better on the beat. Like, I don't really like this track. You feel me? I don't really like this shit. I get this shit like a, a, a 7 flat. You feel me? Probably a 6.5. Like, I'm not really feeling this. You feel me? Probably will usually be doing better. Like, like. <laughs> That's crazy, they got Al Benji shit at the end right here. Like, I I just did a feature with Al Benji too. I'm going I'm gonna do a reaction to one of his songs on here also. Um he he's the one who put me in tune with A V G Mill. Like they all I guess the same group or whatever. You feel me? Um and like I rock I rock with some of their music. Like, I listen to a few of their songs. This you feel me? I 7.5, you feel me? It is a good 7.5, you feel me? But as for a rating, you know, I keep it a stack on here. We don't do no favoritism, none of that. You feel me? I got it. I got to keep it a stack. I get a shit to 7.5, you feel me? I know y'all be waiting for that 7.5. It's crazy. <laughs> I ain't gonna front. I'm not even feeling this shit. I get this shit like a seven flat. I would have gave it the infamous seven point five, but I get this shit a seven flat. This shit is not it. Like both verses was dirt. The hook is alright though, but both verses was dirt. I mean, he got he had some bars in there. He had some punchlines that I caught that was that was calm and shit. But as far as like the whole of the track, like I get this shit like a seven point seven point five. It's not it's not really all that. You feel me? It's it's he said some bars in there that was decent, you feel me, that I liked and shit, but it wasn't all that. The beat selection wasn't all that. And he wasn't disrespectful enough. Y'all know I like to hear that disrespectful shit. Now after y'all watch all those videos and you seen, now you have an idea. Because a lot of y'all haven't been subscribed to my channel for over than, oh, longer than a month. A lot of y'all are new to my channel. So you're just judging based on the videos you've been seeing now. Or you've been judging based on people's opinion of me. You haven't been judging correctly then. You feel me? Because at the end of the day... The video proof shows that 
I've never been biased and I treated everybody fairly. No matter what side of the fence they were on, I was always honest with my opinion. So the people who tuned into my channel after certain altercations, because of the altercations, y'all started thinking, oh, he's a hater and he just doesn't like certain people and he try to pinpoint certain, no, that's not the case. So I advise everyone who's new to my channel, go watch my old videos before you pass judgment. You understand? I know I'm 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 wearing a red do rag today. A lot of niggas be like, oh yo, you wear that same black do rag. I didn't wear the red do rag for that reason, but I'm I have a red do rag on today, so it's evident that I have different do rags. And I have a black one under it too, as you can see. I did a washing style again, so I had on two do rags. You know I me? Mean? One do rag is, is is wet and the other do rag is a dry do rag to soak up the moisture of the wetness in the waist. But whoever got waves know what I'm talking about. But anyway, now that y'all saw all of that, y'all could actually come, if, if, it's still gonna have a lot of people that's still gonna be like, yo, you know what, fuck this nigga. You know, you know why? Cause they choose their, they chose their side already. They wanna be a hater. They wanna be that person that hate upper class. Cause a lot of people in my comment section, they get the most likes of their life by commenting hate comments in my comment section. Because other hate, other haters or other people who are fans of people I got issues with like their hate comments. You feel I me? Mean? You go to some of these people's social media, their pictures don't get as much like as their hate comments under my videos. That goes to show you, nigga, BMG got the city hot. I'm somebody, you're nobody. Now you're gonna feel away me saying that, I guarantee you, nigga, you're nobody. All you got is like 12,000 subs. At the end of the day, look at the period of time I did 12,000 subs and also, look at all the work that I put in to get these 12,000 subs. You feel me? I do have a loyal, a loyal fan base. But, y'all, the fans need to start coming in the comment section more. When y'all see these haters hating, y'all need to let niggas know why I want because the fans are more in tune than the haters. So, wise them up. When y'all see them in the comment section saying this stupid shit, just wise them up. You feel me? Because a lot of them, they unaware. You know what I'm saying? But... Y'all comment in the comment section below. Let me know what y'all think of this video. I know a lot of people, it's not going to change their mind. They're going to still fuck upper class and still whatever. But anybody with any type of sense and is mature enough, they'll be like, oh, shit. Yeah, I was wrong. I really thought this nigga really didn't like these niggas because I just subscribed to his channel. I just saw his videos. I The last few videos I've been seeing is like he saying they shit is whack and they had an argument. Woo, woo. So I don't like it. I don't like him for that. But now that you see, like, from time past, it's not that. You feel me? So go tune into all my old videos. You feel me? It might be an old song that y'all be commenting your reactor, an old song. I probably did it already. You, all you got to do is type in upper class at the end of that, the name of that song. So the title of the song is Ah Ah Ah. You just put upper class reaction at the end and you'll find it. You feel me? But I don't want to make this video super long, so I'm going to end the video here. And I appreciate everyone that subscribed, everyone that likes and supports my video. You know, we on the road to 15,000 subscribers. You feel me? So let's get there quick. You feel what I'm saying? And go sub to my other channel too also. It's your boy Upper Class.